everybody. Welcome to Unit 12, Week 2 of Foundations. And this week, we're going to get into some um, bigger words. And last week, we are talking about words with two syllables. And we're going to continue talking about words with two syllables. But this time, they have a long and a short vowel. So. Before we get started, we're going to go over um, our glued sounds and we're going to go over our trick words for unit 12. Okay, so let's get started. Okay. A, N, fan, an. A, M, ham, am. A, L, L, ball, all. I, N, G, ring, ing. U N G long ung O N G song ong A N G fang ang U N K junk unk O N K honk onk A N K bank ink I N K pink ink All right Let's go ahead and do our trick words Are you ready Mr. Mrs. Nope, other way. Little. Want. Own. Ben. Month. People. All right, let's get started. So, boys and girls, last week we talked about two syllable words. And we're going to continue to talk about our, our two syllable words. We, it's really important as you're reading to look all the way through that word to figure out all of those little spelling patterns that we've been learning about. So, I'm going to push my camera down at my magnetic board and <clears throat> I'm going to turn it around for you. Okay, so the first word that I am going to talk about is the word mistake, okay? So I am going to use these boxes to separate the word, and then down below, I'm going to show you the word all together. So if I am tapping out mistake, mm, eh, what do I need next? Eh. Okay. Mm, is. And then the next section I hear is take. And I hear that A. So I know that there's a silent E at the end. So t, t, t. A. And I know it's going to be a K and not a CK because it has a silent E. We wouldn't put that CK there. We'd put just the K. All right. Mistake. So that's a two-syllable word. And then, actually, I'll just push these together, make it easier. So the word mistake, it's a long one, but you can definitely tap all those sounds out because those are all spelling patterns that you know. So when we separate the word again into two syllables, it's mistake, okay? And then it makes one word. All right, let's spell away mistake. M-I-S-T-A-K-E, okay. The next word I want to talk about is the word invite. All right, again, there's two syllables in in, but let's tap it out. I. What do you hear? N. In. We all know how to spell the word in. So there's our first syllable, in. Now I want the second syllable, v-ite. V. We know what letter makes v. What is it? V, if you said V, kiss your brain, 
eye. And Mrs. Holman doesn't have another pink eye, but I'm going to use my marker. All right. Invite. And then, of course, at the end is that silent E. So together, boys and girls, invite. I will invite you to my party. That word can be broken up again into two syllables. Invite. Okay? So that's... Um, that's how we break up these words. We look for the vowels in, so there's our short vowel, and vi I is our long vowel. All right, let's spell it away. I N V I, I'll just erase that one. T E. All right. Okay, let's move this back up here. Okay, so boys and girls, when we are thinking about spelling the word, we're going to say it to ourselves several times and those words, you should all know those spelling patterns. Sometimes it's gonna be a little tricky as the words get a little bit longer, but I know that you can do it because we have been working on all of those spelling patterns for a long time. So. On our agenda, I'm going to put all of those words to practice, and they're going to have a short vowel sound, and they're going to have a long vowel sound. Okay, so um, before, nope, we'll do that tomorrow. Okay, all right, boys and girls, this was a short one today, so make sure you're practicing those spelling words on our agenda. Have a good day.